The Info Wars does right over here. We've got the media center uh, set up right across from the stage where Donald Trump will be speaking right there. Maybe we can get a word in. We'll see what happens. The guy at the front knew that I was the uh, the drug smuggling guy that was uh, that caught that footage on the border in Laredo, Texas, and said, "Oh yeah, you're the guy that was on Drudge." So maybe they'll be like, "Hey Trump, give these guys a shot." So we'll see. Maybe we can ask him about the border and some other things. So stay tuned for more reports. I'm going to try to have some of this up live on Periscope, different other things throughout the night, so you guys can see it. We're going to get some HD. Footage footage and we're going to talk to some people outside after the event as well and see what they think what they're looking for in a presidential candidate uh, who they like who they don't like so stay tuned for more reports at infowars.com i'm joe biggs we've reached a critical juncture in the globalist program that's why we're launching operation money bomb 2015 and with the money we raise from this we will be able to stay on the satellites and get on cable stations across north america reaching tens of millions of more people right at the time they're receptive and looking for answers so join us this september 16th and 17th we're charging up getting ready and going in fool me once shame on you fool me twice shame on me Vote for Jeb, or you're just f***ing stupid. I'm running for president. Everyday Americans need a champion, and I want to be that champion. I'm hitting the road to earn your vote, and I hope you'll join me on this journey. A clean, toxic-free body is the foundation of true health. Introducing Deep Cleanse by InfoWarsLife.com, a scientifically formulated blend of nanocolloidal zeolites and organic ingredients that aid the body in cleansing chemicals and toxic metals. Using our proprietary multi-step extraction technology, Deep Cleanse is our most affordable all-in-one cleanser. With concentrated organic compounds like cilantro, milk thistle, fulvic acid, orange peel, zeolites, and others, Deep Cleanse doesn't hold back. Instead of buying five, six, or even seven different cleansing products. We use decades-old scientific research to put together the Rolls-Royce of all-in-one cleansing. Look, there's a reason Deep Cleanse is the only product on the market that uses our proprietary Spigerex herbal processing technique. We use only the highest quality organic herbs backed by serious research, and we still bring it to you at the best price out there. If you wish to find Deep Cleanse and experience the all-in-one cleansing, visit InfoWarsLife.com. That's InfoWarsLife.com or call 888-253-3139. Introducing Secret 12, the new InfoWars Life Vitamin B12 formulation. Most forms of vitamin B12 are highly processed and synthetic and could not be properly absorbed by the body. That's why for real results, so many are having to turn to painful B12 injections, which are known to have higher absorption rates. Now, InfoWarsLife.com is excited to announce that we can bring you our most bioactive, powerful form of B12 that has been developed with our exclusive perfected process. Secret 12 is a binary of nutramedical grade bioavailable coenzyme forms of B12, methylcobalamin, the same kind used in B12 injections, and adenosylcobalamin. Secret 12 is simply taken by mouth, right on the tongue, and then swallowed. No needles, no injections. Don't take my word for it. Try it for yourself. Discover the secret. Secret 12. Secure your revolutionary Secret 12 formula right now at InfoWarsLife.com or call 888-253-3139. How was your college experience? That's a question I get asked every now and again. And when I meet young high school age people, they're trying to make that decision whether or not they're going to go to college or what they're going to do. I'll tell anybody who wants to know, hell, I'll tell you right now, I left school with about $6,000 worth of debt. So if you meet somebody who wants you to go to some big state school or go to some private school, ask them point blank, how much student loan debt do you have? And they go, oh, that's personal, that's private. Remember, it's going to affect you in your personal and your private life as well. And for more on this, we have Leanne McAdoo. Leanne? It absolutely will. And parents have been fighting for this information for for years. Uh, they want to know if I'm going to send my kid to university, what's going to be the return on my investment? And so the U.S. government, they sort of helped out with this, but it was somewhat of a data dump. Uh, they released a huge amount of information. It's called the College Scorecard. You can look that up on the government website. Uh, but basically what they did is they collated all this data so that uh, they can show how much student loan debt was taken out per student and in exchange for the earnings they could expect after graduation. And so uh, basically they were able to do this by taking out the tax information of people who took out Pell Grants and federal mm -hmm. loans. So 10 years later, how much are they earning after school? And it was pretty shocking because at hundreds 
of colleges, less than half of students met the $25,000 per year threshold. So that's what a high school graduate is making, $25,000 a year. Wow. Uh, about over 48% of them were earning, earning less than that. Some earning just $10,000 per year. So these are people that have accumulated massive student loan debt. And so you can see why colleges, universities um, have really been against getting this data out there. They mean, of it course, really because, difficult. you know, I, I got into that mentality like you have to go to school, you have to do this stuff. And then I would go back and meet people who I went to high school with and you know, they didn't go to college or they, you know, they went to trade school, whatever. And they're like, yeah, you know, I work at, you know, uh, some restaurant, but I have no debt. Meanwhile, right. you got somebody who went to the big school, you know, they have their degree and they're working at the Gap. No, that's absolutely right. If you have someone that's going to go to a vocational school, they're going to maybe go there for a year, two years. They're going to get right out. They've got no debt. They're immediately making income, whereas their peers are still in school, going to get out with like $30,000 worth of debt, and they're already set back, and there's no guarantee of how much you're going to be earning. And in a lot of cases, it's not worth it. And I'll tell anybody out there, the field, any field you go to is highly competitive. I mean, it's to a point now where you need basically a bachelor's degree to get a job as a receptionist somewhere. Yeah, I mean, they were saying bachelor's degrees required for getting a job at McDonald's and things like that. So there are just too many students enrolling in school. And why is that? It's because they're making the money so easy to, to get. And that's the big problem is that these universities, all they care about is all of that free money. All of that free money coming in because their big thing that they need to worry about is the front end enrollment. As long as they can get people enrolling into the school, they can get all of that federal money. They don't care if you graduate. They don't care how much money you're gonna earn afterward. They don't care if you drop out. They, that's not their concern. And that's the big issue is that these, these universities aren't being penalized for dropout rate or people who don't get an, a, a well-paying job that are able to pay back their student loan debt. And so obviously this is causing a crisis. The next big crisis that's about to hit this country is from the massive student loan debt because there are so many people out there that have hundreds of thousands of dollars worth of debt. You know, their doctors don't pay their tuition off until, you know, 20 years after Yeah, their... I knew a guy who was studying to be a doctor and he told me basically his view on it is he, I think he had like $300,000 worth of debt. He had no intention of paying back this debt. He said, I'm gonna make minimal payments every month. I'm gonna live in a big house, ride my jet ski and just have this debt until I die. Yeah, I know a lot of people who do that, and it seems to be, you know, they, they allow it to happen. If you want to pay $5 a month for the rest of your life, well, hey, you're still up to date on your student loan debt, and this is what some people have to do. It's, it's, it's nearly impossible to get rid of student loan debt. Uh, it always stays on your credit. But check this out. I mean, this is a Think Progress article, and this is to show you just what a joke it is, how the government could make public college free for all students. So tuition at public colleges came to $62.6 billion in 2012. Well, the government already spends uh, more than that to subsidize the cost of college. So they spent $69 billion in grants, tax breaks, and work study funds. So they spent more than mm -hmm. what they could have paid for college tuition for all people who were enrolled in 2012. But that's not it. <laughs> they also spent another $107.4 billion on student loans. So they could have spent double the amount, spent, sent double the amount of people to school mm -hmm. and then some. Instead, they were pushing out all of these, spent more on loans to get all of these people in who aren't even gonna get jobs afterward. So we could have free college tuition for every student that wants to enroll. And it would also make private colleges have to be more competitive. Instead, what do we have? 600% increase in college tuition uh, since the 1970s. 600% increase, and we certainly haven't seen that return on investment with the wages. Yeah, because I've talked to older people, you know, went to school in the 60s, 70s, and I'd ask them, you know, how much student loan debt did you have? They had very little, you know, maybe $10,000. And they could afford going to college and have an apartment and have a car, you know, by working at McDonald's right. or someplace. It's not like that anymore. Absolutely not. And we were driving down uh, Congress, or not Congress, uh, Lamar today, we went out to lunch and we saw this big banner across the street. It said, all children go to college, no excuses or no exceptions, uh, something along those lines. And, you know, on its face, it sounds good. But as I keep trying to tell people, and I'll tell you guys right now who are <laughs> listening, just because you go to these big schools or you go to any school and you get some big fancy degree, 
doesn't guarantee that you're going to get the job that you want, or especially not the one that you want right away, because I left school, I got my associate's degree in television production in 2007. So from 2007 to 2012, when I worked for Alex, I didn't do anything in my field of choice. It took me that long right. to get a job. You know, so you have to keep all this stuff in mind. And this is, you know, with all the things you have in life, whether it's dad or kids or anything else, you have to factor all this into your decision. And they don't tell you that stuff. They'll oh. tell you the big success story. Mm -hmm. Look at Johnny over here. He got this great job before he even got out of school. And actually that did happen to me when I was still <laughs> in school. I right. got a job while I was in school. But I can tell you for most people in my class, that did not happen. So yep. they, everybody has to keep this into consideration. Well, and, and not to mention the fact that a lot of the jobs, when a lot of people graduate, are going to be automated. So those jobs aren't even going to be there when people graduate, or they're going to spend all of this money, and then in a few years down the line, their job gets taken over by a robot. And then the, the traits that they, they tell people that they should be kind of uh, looking into and really pursuing are those that are unique to us as humans, right? The entrepreneurial skills, the writing, uh, scientific discovery, social interactions, caring about people. Mm -hmm. These are things that can't be replaced with robots. And so they're not gonna tell you, hey, look at Mark Zuckerberg. He was an entrepreneur, or dropped out of school or something like that. They're not gonna, they're not gonna push that on you because they wanna keep funneling all of that money into their university. Absolutely, and that's not to say that all universities are bad or all professors have ill intent. I'm just saying that the way the system is used, it's a huge bubble, as you pointed out, Leanne, is primed to burst. Mm -hmm. I know several people, I'm sure you do as well, that have several thousand dollars worth of debt. Me? They have no, yeah, they, <laughs> they have uh, no careers or really no prospects of careers. They've given up. You know, they went to school for X, Y, Z. They got out in the field. It was too hard. Then they ended up right. working at Cracker Barrel. You know, so there's yeah. a lot of that stuff going on. Nothing gets Cracker Barrel. I enjoy their food that often. <laughs> but um, the point I'm making to you Racist. is like you can go through all this stuff and still wind up back to where you would have been had you just got out of college and went right. and got, I mean, got out of high school and went and got a job. And so many of these things, a lot of the skills, you can teach yourself by watching a YouTube tutorial. Oh, yeah. There are so many things out there that you just you don't need to be paying someone to sit through four more years of history and things that you learned all through and the even in, in college, you know, I was taking, you know, art appreciation. And it's like <laughs> it. Uh, I mean, there's nothing wrong with it. I learned about Rodin and his sculptures and stuff <laughs> like that. But it's not something that's I really needed for my career. But right. I needed that credit. And that's my biggest issue with colleges. If you could go for, you know, 40, 50, 60 hard hours of your degree, you know, you get your math, you get your English and stuff. And then you go out into the world, that would be fine. Right. But they want you to double that, taking all these courses that you that don't you need. you just finished taking for 12 years. And that's what exactly what happened to me. By the time I got to my junior, senior year, I was so bored. I was so over the university because it was just like it takes all that passion and desire out of you because they just like, now let's relearn everything you've been taught since kindergarten. Right. Now, with the Money Bomb coming up this Wednesday, the 16th, all you guys tune into that. Tell us about the social media information. Well, for 27 hours, we're going to be here live. So please tweet us your questions using hashtag MoneyBomb2015. You can tweet me at Leanne McAdoo, Jakari Jax, uh, or also at InfoWars using that hashtag MoneyBomb2015. We've reached a critical juncture in the globalist program. That's why we're launching Operation Money Bomb 2015. So join us this September 16th and 17th. We're charging up, getting ready, and going in. A clean, toxic-free body is the foundation of true health. Introducing Deep Cleanse by InfoWarsLife.com, a scientifically formulated blend of nanocolloidal zeolites and organic ingredients that aid the body in cleansing chemicals and toxic metals. Using our proprietary multi-step extraction technology, Deep Cleanse is our most affordable all-in-one cleanser. With concentrated organic compounds like cilantro, milk thistle, fulvic acid, orange peel, zeolites, and others, Deep Cleanse doesn't hold back. Instead of buying five, six, or even seven different cleansing products. We use decades old scientific research to put together the Rolls Royce of all-in-one cleansing. Look, there's a reason Deep Cleanse is the only product on the market that uses our proprietary Spigerex herbal processing technique. We use only the highest quality organic herbs backed by serious research and we still bring it to you at the best price out there. If you wish to find Deep Cleanse and experience the all-in-one cleansing, visit InfoWarsLife.com. That's InfoWarsLife.com or call 888-253-3139. 
You are watching the InfoWars Nightly News, which airs 7 p.m. Central at InfoWarsNews.com. And your support is helping us defend liberty worldwide.